about? No, I mean, I knew it was gay. In school, they'd whistle at me in the halls and everything. But what really bothered me was I didn't know how to be a man. What, uh, what was your first job as a dancer? At the Jewel Box Review, the drag show. I was 15. I went to audition, but they weren't interested in my dancing. They said, show us your legs, and they took me upstairs to this filthy rat hole, and they shaved my legs, put a pair of nylon stockings on me and high heels. There I was in show business. The asshole of show business, but a job. Why did you tell your parents? I was a dancer in a show. Not what kind, of course. They couldn't stop bragging. Go on, Pa. And the show was going to Chicago. And my parents wanted to bring my suitcase down to the theater after the show to say goodbye. And I don't know why I said, OK. Well, we were doing this oriental number. And I was wearing this slinky oriental dress and this enormous headdress with gold balls hanging all over it. And I was going down the steps for the finale when I saw my parents by the stage door. They got there too early. I freaked out. I didn't know what to do. So I ran past them as quick as I could, hoping they wouldn't recognize me. But the minute I passed, I heard my mother say, oh my god, I died. After the show, I took off my makeup and put on my clothes, not knowing if they'd be downstairs or what. But there they were, standing in the middle of all these freaks. You should have seen my parents. They didn't know where to look. My mother had the guts to look me in the eyes. I could tell she'd been crying. Make sure you eat good, she said. But then my father couldn't even look at me. Take care of yourself, he said. And they started out. But then my father turned around and went over to the producer. Take care of my son, he said. And that was the first time he ever called me that. <laughs> 